Welcome to Let's Play Dark Souls 2, episode 28, Keep the Bell Ringing. I'm not human, and I'm wondering if I should change. I don't think so. Okay, going through the, the Iron Keep. I figured I'd run through the the bell soul today. But what armor to wear? Am I still looking for heat resistance? 10, 12, 14, 19. I saw 19. Okay, I'm looking at the first, there's a 53. First column of numbers, third from the bottom. It's my fire resistance. I saw 18. I thought I saw 19, did I? No, is 18 the highest? So 28, 28 twice, that puts me at 80% though. That's way too high. Wow. This is a culprit here, so looking for something to keep. Okay, so that's uh, 33 at 68%. Wait a second. 33. I'm just going to put it on. Okay, 68%. So now I'm just looking for something with more. That's 33 at 64%. That's pretty, that's probably about as good as I'm going to get. Yeah. I can't afford that being over 70% weight. Okay, anything else I want to take into the bell keepers with me? I don't think I want any buffs. Handy. <laughs> okay, here we go. Uh oh. He's gonna kill me if maybe. That didn't kill him? Wow! <sighs> Whoops! Lost my bow and arrow here. Oh man! I was hoping I could pull one without the other guy noticing. Uh oh. Man. I'm playing a little PvP on my other channel, so my timing's just a little off. That's not what I wanted. <laughs> That's not what I wanted either. I didn't want to fight out here because there's an archer out here that would cause me a lot of trouble.
If you have the ferrous stones to spare, this is a nice little diversion. But once you sit at the bonfire up here, you're trapped. You have to go through the area. Thunder Quartz Ring plus one. That's lightning protection, right? Increases lightning defense. By 80 points. So you determine if you don't want to go through the Bell Soul, is it worth it? Is it worth the Ferris Stone to get that ring? Okay, you talked me into it. I'm leaving. No. Two forty six, that's all. wasn't too difficult. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Try to hold off that cough. Didn't work. Well, hell, this is just too easy. But not to fear, it's going to get a lot harder here, real quick. I 
hope I can pull these guys one at a time. Yep. No invaders yet. This guy looks like a baddie, doesn't he? What's he backing off for? That's probably the easiest run I ever had to get this far. Oh, I took a chance there. Wait a sec, am I... Okay, two repair powders left. And that's probably not gonna... Oh, did my halberd break? Yes, too late. Shoot, what a waste of powder. Still no invasions? I thought there were two black phantoms up here. Ah, there's one. Poison arrows work good here too, but... Oh... What's going on? I was hitting him! Meanwhile, I got a guy coming after me. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, going for the backstab. He's pretty fast. Damn! He's really fast. Where's all the bell keepers? Got me. I think I'm gonna cheese this guy too. They're kinda hard to hit that low to the ground. Hard to see him uh, pull back his bow, too. Oh, come on. I'm getting through the whole area without a single invasion? That sucks. And I don't think it's because I'm not human. Human effigy, triclops snake torches. Well, yeah, I know that. It's around the corner. strength weapon. No. Oh, it was a sword. Black Knight Great Sword. I don't see anything that looks like a Black Knight Great Sword. Twenty-eight strength, twelve each of intelligence and faith. So when you rest at the bonfire, that platform resets. That's interesting. <laughs> Come chase after me. No, go ahead. The way's clear. I cleared the way for you. Oh, shoot. Got it. Don't touch the Oh man.
Let's see if this guy can get burned up by fire. Or if he'll fall to his death. This guy is a nuisance. He'll take pot shots at you all day. You know what guys, I think I'm going to take a run back to Majula, fix my halberd. I can reinforce anything. Oh, what about my magic maze? So that's 198. This is up to 117. Okay, so the Morning Star has 93 bleed, but the magic maze has 117 magic. Still need twinkling. One more twinkling. I think I am going to take the magic mace up to 117. So that's a four. And this is a seven. I'll be around if you make it back. Time to buy some more life gems too while I'm here. I knew you. this video segment and take it up right here. Okay, we'd be back. We'd be back.
Okay, taking a chance. Let's see how the magic mace does against this guy. Four ninety nine, eh, not bad. Wow, wow. Is there a way? Nope. He just goes right to work on that. Uh... Ah, couldn't row backwards fast enough. Should have done an R2. Oh, you little. <laughs> that archer. Oh, shoot. <laughs> okay, got to be careful of these little pressure traps. I'll put... Uh, oh. Lava down these little uh, trays. And I'm going to need a lot more uh, heat resistance to get to that chest. Well, shoot. I thought there was something else down here. Uh-oh. Sprung one. Going for the backstab. I know there's a cheesy way to get these guys down, but.
pause hoping to push him off the edge. Fire did most of the work for me. <laughs> I'm going to grab this shiny before I go upstairs. Large soul, monastery charm. I didn't time that very well. Okay, these pots. These pots, I think, raise your fire resistance. So it might be a matter of breaking, rolling through these five or six pots and then running for that chest. But I'm not going to try it now. If I remember right, I think that's a mimic. Is a mimic. That was a mimic. Lightning wing spear and dark armor. Not very good fire protection, but good protection overall. Ten pounds, though. A lot of blood stains here, but I don't think this is a mimic. This is real close to the point of no return. If I jump off of this platform, I have to go through. Tell you what guys, I'm gonna end the video here. Yes. See if I can keep a sh get a short one up so they're not 45 minutes long. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. Talk to you later.